Hello everybody and welcome to Wildlands. Now in this video, we're going to be doing some missions. I know a lot of people have been playing this game, guys, and they've been just kind of jumping bikes and all kinds of different stuff. But I'm interested in the storyline. I've always liked uh, Tom Clancy games and they've always... Is this Tom Clancy? Hold on. Well, the case has gone MIA, um, but it is Tom Clancy because I just looked at the uh, back screen there. And oh, for being prior service, this game is legit. Because something that I did when I was in the service, guys, was, um, was human intelligence. And we worked directly with the frontline guys and all kinds of fun stuff. Um, but I can't go into exactly what I did. But this game hits home. And I'm super excited for it. So uh, we have a lot of customization here. Let's see what I got here. I kind of, I shaved my beard, so uh, fortunately I can't rock the lumberjack. Let's see, what do we got? Business beard? Hmm. Yeah, yeah, that's it. we'll go with that one. Hair, squared away. I got a little bit more fluff on top. Uh, nope, that's a little too slick. There we go. Hey, the undercut. That's, that's what I got going on. I got brown hair, facial detail. Razor lash. Ooh, I'm so. Ooh, a scar. A bump. A burn. Nope. I'm a pretty boy. All right. Now we got an appearance. Body details. Facial paint. No, we're good. Arm tattoos. Ooh. Ooh. The Santa Maria. Damn, that is very detailed. Uh, sapper. Okay. That's legit. Like the tribal, that's pretty cool. Traditional sleeve. Okay, Penicent and DJ. Oh, I don't have that one. I like that one. Let's do that. Battle flag, that's pretty sick. No, not so much on that one. Whoa. Show off the kitties. We're going to go with the battle flag and eagle. Let's be all like, America! America! Yeah! That's pretty badass. So, commando, no. No. <laughs> Close. Okay, well, it just bounced right back to that. So, got a hoodie. There's a lot of shit. We want to show off our tattoos. Let's go tank top. Business kit. Nope. Let's go tank top. What kind of co Ooh, we can do colors? Oh, look at that. Nikes. Ah, the use the UCP for the ACUs. That is pretty cool. We're gonna go with marine camo. I always like these ones. Those ones are sick. Vests. None. But apparently I need a backpack. I have to have a backpack. I mean, you just got to. But, I don't know, an LBV. An LBE is pretty good. IBA. Oh. Yeah, we don't want to get shot. Shoulder pads. We'll just do the normal IBA. Ah, oh, that's bringing back memories. Legit pants. Oh, can I go shorts? No, I got jeans with knee pads and cargos and a ghillie with leaves. <laughs> We're not going to go that crazy. Ah, uh, just rock those and we'll go black. Yeah, we're starting to come together here. Always got a ooh, hiking shoes. Nope. Got to go with combat boots. Got to. Nope. No ghillie suit for me. Accessories. I wear. Ooh. Oakley's. Oh, I am a badass. Ooh, I am an original badass. Arr, I got an eye patch. Uh, ballistic goggles. Okay, that's good. Aviators. Another eye patch. Oh, wait. I just went down. Um, God, you need eye pro. We're going to go with that. Face wear. Oh. Oh, that looks dumb. 
a scarf, gas mask, ballistics mask, a face mask. Oh, I could be like Bane. Not that I could talk like him at all. <laughs> all right, we'll rock the bandana. I think we're going to go with black, though. Yeah, that looks legit. Headwear. Oh, <laughs> howdy, partner. Did you come here to fight? That looks legit. Let's get this. Uh, I can't really see my shirt anymore. But maybe I should go black so it matches my hat. Can I go black? Yes, I can. Oh, yeah. Headset. Oh, I got an earpiece. Oh, damn. It looks legit. Yeah, we're going to rock that one. Handwear? You know we'd be rocking the fingerness. Ooh, what about none? Yeah, that looks a lot better. Backpacks? Yeah, we just rocked the camelback, man. Mm. Oh, I don't know. Let's see here. Do I need, like, a backpack? We'll go with that one. Because maybe it allows me to carry, like, more weapons, maybe? Patches? Animals? Oh, okay, we're not doing any of that. Okay. Well, I think we are officially badass and awesome at this point. So, without further ado... Let's save our character and move on. Oh, oh, I'm a badass. Challenging. The way Ghost Recon is meant to be played. Elite. For experienced players that look for more thrills. Ghost. Extremely difficult. Reme recommended only for the best players. Um, hmm. I am not the best player. So, we're going to go to... veteran because i think i might suck at this game now i did load it up one time i played through a couple missions um i like the first person shooter aspect better than anything else however um i do really enjoy this game i like the the feel of it the open land borders that's legit for me Agent they murdered. You knew him? He was a friend of mine. Sorry for your loss. I could say it comes with a job, but it doesn't get any easier. No, it doesn't. Guess you've been down here a while? I've been living as Karen Bowman, international aid worker, for just about five years. Means living rough, but as a cover, it gets me out and about. At least it comes with a chopper. How'd you get in country? A fluent business class from Manaus. Hey, I'm refreshed and ready for work, right? I just hitched rides from Barranco, Peru. How about you? I got on board a bus in Huey, Argentina, and drank all the way to Via Zone. Nobody wants to deal with a drunk on the bus. That explains why you smell like ass. I've heard rumors about you guys. I was a rookie field officer in Moscow when the coup went down. There was talk you were involved? Nah, it must have been someone else. We were never there. It's not every day you get to meet an urban legend in the flesh. Huh, you should tell that to my kid. Maybe he'd listen when I tell him to take the trash out. 
Is it hard being someone who doesn't officially exist? You tell me, Karen Bowman, international aid worker. I'm sure you've seen the horrible, fucked up shit humans are capable of when there are zero repercussions. But let me tell you right now, no matter how you compartmentalize, how you desensitize, you can't prepare for El Sueño. He's got a religious street that rates pretty close to delusional. He's taken vows of poverty, chastity. If he's not in it for the chocha or the money, he's in it for the power. This joint task force is CIA, DEA, JSOC. I'm your resident spook for this ride. Welcome to Operation Kingslayer. Our briefing said there'd be a contingent of locals. The guitar is 26. They're a group of rebels who've been giving Unidad and Santa Blanca some resistance. We'll meet their leader, Pakatari, as soon as we touch down. Bolivians have a long history of hating us Yankees, but this time, let's hope the enemy of my enemy will be my friend. But don't turn your back on him. I'm not going to. Soldiers. This is the help you promised? That Sandoval promised? A single Yankee died, so you send a handful of soldiers. Hundreds of Bolivians have died from Santa Blanca's bullets. Where will my hundreds of soldiers come from? As Americans, we aren't here, remember? These soldiers are the best covert ops team our country has to offer. With their help, you won't need hundreds of soldiers. Are you familiar with the word Huber, Senora Bowman? Meet Pakatari, leader of the resistance group Kataris 26. We will be working with the rebels to destabilize Santa Blanca's organization. They've been fighting Santa Blanca and corrupt Bolivian officials for nearly six years now. We'll need to coordinate targets. There is no time for this. We have information on Amaru's whereabouts. Amaru? You found him? Amaru is one of the founders of the Kataris 26. More than that, her group is founded on his ideas. Without his theories of an agrarian proletariat, there would be no organized resistance against Santa Blanca and the corruption in our government. Amaru must be saved. If you were to assist my people, it would do much to earn my confidence. Where is he? We do not know exactly. We know he is in this province and that there is a Santa Blanca lieutenant who knows where he is. I'll put a call into the activity, see if they can dig more intel out of the airwaves. Start looking for that lieutenant and keep me informed of everything via sat phone. Good hunting. Saving Amaro is important to our cause, Yankee. Make sure you don't kill the Santa Blanca lieutenant before you get the chance to ask him questions. Woo! And we are in, ladies and gentlemen. Welcome to Tom Clancy's Wildlands. My guy just looks like a total badass. I love it. All right, so let's continue on. Time to earn your pay, people. Put on, yes, your, game put on your game faces. I tell you, I'm not too comfortable working with Pakatari and these rebels. Their kind of ideology always ends up with more yep, bodies. Yep, sure does. So, however, I don't think I have anything I can do. In the ground. What's your feeling on this? Uh, end of the day, this is a revenge mission. We need to focus and get this done quick before we get stuck between local politics and the firestorm of cartel bullets. First objective, track down that Santa Blanca lieutenant so we can Damn, find the model. Alright, let's go. Hello? Bien, camarada. Congratulations on defending the hospital from a lemisarius man. We couldn't have done it without you. Don't mention it, Katari. Just add it to your bill. There is one more thing. Before Lemisario's men attacked the hospital, one of my people loaded a truck with vaccines and tried to get them to safety. Unfortunately, he was stopped at the unit at checkpoint and the truck was confiscated. Mm. It's vital we get those oh, vaccines, shit. Yankee. The truck is at the unit at base now. I know it's asking much of you, but frankly, 
There's no one else who can do okay. it. Where do I Understood. need to go? We'll see what we can do. Yes. Oh, that was not <laughs> where I was supposed to go. Let's, we're doing the mission. That one. Unidad has confiscated a truck no. full of medicines from the rebels. I want you to take it back and get it to Katari's people. They'll make sure it's put to good use. Oh. That's the one I need to go A senior to. rebel leader named Amaru has been captured by the uh, cartel. Yes. Interrogate a Santa Blanca lieutenant for Amaru's location, then go and extract him. Aye, aye, Captain. I really... <laughs> this game is just... It's just so much fun. The openness that you're like, Oh, I need to go over here and do a side mission over here and this kind of stuff. And I really do thoroughly enjoy... Excuse, excuse me, excuse me, come up there. Um, we will be playing this online via co-op here soon, and we will be inviting you guys to join us live. And we will also, guys, uh, be doing some live charities here soon. Uh, we got some orphanages that we're going to sponsor that's down in uh, South America, and uh, we are super excited to start that here soon. Um, as well as game play requests as we continue on. Break. Breaks work. I thought I was going to drift that right in there. Alright, let's just take a look, look here. Look alive, right we here. got company. Okay. Oh, recon tutorial. Uh huh. Yep. Mm hmm. Use binoculars. Got it. Binoculars out. That's a bad guy. He's a bad guy. Stealth tutorial. Walk up. Crouch. Direct arrows indicate who is spotting you. Switch to your handgun. Sounds good. Can I? Okay, there we go. Don't want to spook the target. You're right. Switch to suppressors. Switching to all my guns have suppressors because I am a badass. Oh yes. Good eyes on the target. Let's move. Ooh. That's a kill. Headshot. Nothing good. Let's get our little drony drone out on this one. Oh, I spotted one with submachine guns. It was not my drone. <laughs> that was just me. Ah, oh, there we go. Yay! I got a target carrying submachine guns. I got a third target. That there we go. Five. There we go. Oh, oh, too far, too far, too far. Okay. So. You take him out, and then. Ready. Call the shot. Yep. You just hold on one second. Oh, I don't have any sights. Target down. Yeah, like a boss. Uh huh. Hiya. Yes. Messed up, man. They got messed up. Tag these supplies. We'll leave a marker so the rebels can pick up these supplies later. That's right. Now it took me a long time, guys, to understand. Like, what, oh, I guess I shouldn't say long time because I only played for about an hour max. Um, how these little supply crates actually work? They you they're used to generate that kind of medication plus 50 uh, to help you get extra material or things you can do uh, in game. Such as upgrades, stuff like that. Because it is almost like an RPG in that sense. They're looking for you. Watch yourself. Ready to engage. Okay. Uh, nope. Oh! <laughs> that's like what it would, that's how it actually would probably happen. Like, oh, I see something over here. I need to go investigate. And then, pew! Headshot. Or nut shot, whatever works. So, uh, hang out on there. Hey, we got an arco with a submachine gun. Yep, I Over noticed that. Sandbag emplacement. Yeah, it's right here. Oh, uh, okay, there we go. I was going to say, no! Over by the sandbag replacement. Say the word, boss. I'm not seeing this other guy. Guys didn't call him out very well. Hmm. 
No, I... Gosh. Tango down. Mm-hmm. Watching and they're searching for you. Stay the hell down. Oh, you speak a Nazi Spanish. Yep. Just shut up. Get down. Here's the deal, asshole. You answer my questions, or I put a bullet in your gut and leave you to die in your own shit. No enciendas? Chill the fuck out, cabron. What do you want? Tomorrow, Everything. Where can I find him? <laughs> you serious? That's what this is about? Yeah. Sure thing. He's at Atoya Farm. Go on. Then you can see what we do to people who fuck with us. People like you. Yep. Ooh, you got knocked up. We need to Bogal. get this done in a hurry. Maru's an old man. He's not gonna last long under torture. Shit, if they've been working on him for a while, there's a good chance he's already dead. Maybe, That's not maybe a good not. thing. Armour is a major player in the rebel movement. The cartel will keep him alive as long as they can to find out what he knows. We can't afford to take any chances. There's too much riding on this. Let's move. Okay. Spotting another tango, and baby makes three. I'm not seeing another person though. Let's get moving. The cartel isn't gonna wait around for us to track down and rescue Amaru. Do you hear the drone, man? Bring it back. Oh, I'm bringing it back. Don't you worry. What if I can just pop a grenade over here by these guys? Drag <laughs> out. Yeah, yeah. Ooh, I got two of them. They didn't know something was up before, they sure as hell do now. They know we're here. Do they? Do they? I think they may. There we go. Got that guy. And I like the ability to, uh, like, choose what you want to do. Like, you can totally go in all stealth mode and just, like, screw people up. Or you could send your guys in to flank them and do the sneak, uh, the sinking shots. And just annihilate everybody. There's something in here. Okay, I need this. Tag those supplies. Yep. I heard a truck backing up. Now, the only thing I would say would be awesome was to be able to individualize, tell your people to go, you, John, go here. Pat, you go over to the right. And then Marcy, you're going to stay in the back. And I'm going to flank to the left. That would make a lot more sense. In my mind. Anyways, that's that's me. I don't know. Oh, that guy scared me. I was like, I don't know what that is. Take document. Yes. Ah. Oh, yes. I don't know what that means. The village is known to need a haven for rebels. Why do these rebels even bother? Kill them all. The whole village. Visit Divine Wrath upon Kulta. Good to go. And wipe it off the face of the earth. Lado, this... Al rato. Just... These are terrorists. They're not even like drug lords anymore. Ooh, oh. Sorry. Okay. Jeep's in pretty good condition. Pretty good. Okay. We're doing good. We're doing good. Uh-huh. 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 Yeah. Uh huh. Now I'm wondering in the in the two player mode, which is what we're gonna find out here soon. Oh gosh, is if uh, you control with one teammate, like since there's a squad of four people, if your cooperative person is able to control the other person, ooh, excuse me, and the other person's with you, because that would be uh, oh crap. Going this way. Um, because that would be awesome because of the sole fact that you could be a lot more tactical in oh shit. Oh I am not very good at driving apparently. Okay, anyways, you could be a lot more got some air. A lot more tactical in that aspect. Okay, we only got a cracked windshield. This is a pretty high endurance Jeep. This thing is freaking amazing. Whoa. Like speed wobbles. Woo! Woo! 
Oh, 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 excuse me. Watch out, guys. Come through. Oh! I don't think I ran him over. Jeez Louise. I got way across the road. Yep, because we are getting close. Awesome. Alright, everybody out. Alright. Guys, we're doing pretty good. Activity nearby. That's awesome. Let's see how close we are. Oh, we're a little bit far away here. I see a second target. There's a helicopter a over there. Mm hmm mm hmm Who else? He makes five. There's six. Seven. So if I can... If I had like a grenade launcher, that would be like legit. Yo, cartel yes. gunman. Point him out. The barn, inside. Uh-huh. Equip or remove your weapon suppressor with the up directional pad. Use pressure to deal with enemy remaining undetected. Remove your suppressor in open combat to deal as much damage as possible. Alright. Well, we're going to be pretty quiet on this one. I don't want to screw this up. Altitude, 2,089 meters. Hey, what's up, S.A.? There's a guy inside this house. I know. Ah, uh -huh, I got him. Keep an eye on your background. <gasps> I found them all. Ha <laughs> ha. Okay. Coming up on a Toyo farm. Remember, a lot of these Sicarios are ex-military. ID your targets. If Amaru gets killed by a stray round, Operation Kingslayer will be dead in the water before it even starts. Let's yep, go. Yep. Already taken him out. Wish I had a scope. He made some noise, though. Oh, these guys are dropping like flies. They don't even know what's going on. Watch your step. These guys know something's up. They don't know I'm here, though. Right? Coming right at us. What's the word? Boss? Down. Don't worry. Ready? Fire, Open fire. 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 Copy that. <laughs> I think we effectively took them all out. Excuse me. I took them all out. Yes. Let's take the equipment. Ah, yes. Is it this one that gets the sight? Yes, it is. I freaking love this part of the game, where it legitimately shows the weapon coming apart as you would if you were disassembling it. You got the suppressor, you have your trigger, magazine, underbarrel, rail, uh, muzzle, everything. Even the stock, if you made it. Like right now, it has a collapsible buttstock right now. Um, but now I have a freaking scope. And I am. And then you slap it all back together, and it just. So freaking awesome. Oh, it's just great. Boom. Now I have to uh, load out. Right? No, I gotta find a weapon. I gotta find it. Yeah, yeah, I hear you. You just shut up for a second. Yep, I hear you yelling. Just wait. Tag this. Run over here. Is this what got my... Oh, I, that's what got it. Okay. okay so. Yeah, yeah, yeah. I hear you. I hear you. I can, I can open it anytime. There we go. Boop! Hello. Would you like to come with me? I'll save you. Oh, I don't need to bow. <laughs> Hello. <laughs> Hello. Hello. We're getting you out of here. Yeah, you fucked up, man. I ain't gonna lie. All right, let's go. I... I think I'm okay at driving these. 
I always remember playing the like Battlefield 1942 on like the PC with my dad and uh, <laughs> like kamikaze people with the jets. That was always the funnest. Where are you taking? All right. Back to your friends. Entonces Pacatari has made his deal with the malditos extranjeros, young fool. Pick it up with him, senor. Yeah, pick it up with him. I'm just here doing the cool stuff. I'm a freaking awesome person. Yeah. What a nice flight. I am. Apparently, I'm a licensed pilot, if you know what I mean. Just kidding. No, I'm not, because it's just going crazy right now. <laughs> Come on. There you go. A little bit forward. There we go. Yeah. Left turn and release for a quick turn. Oh. Well. We don't need to dive bomb the shrubs there, but. Yes. Wish it told you how fast you were going. That would be legit. Woo! Dive, dive, dive. Oh my gosh, it's so awesome. And we'll slow her down. Look at this. Man. Is this a, oh shit. Okay, I spoke too soon. Landing is the hard part. Okay, got it, got it. Okay. Okay. Yes, it is. Nope, I need down. <laughs> Alright, everybody out. Oh, I will take you, of course. I will take equipment. What do you got for me? Nice. Oh, a sniper rifle. I, I like the sniper rifles. I got your amigo, and don't you worry. Because I... Saved him for you. Are you hurt? Yeah, yeah, he's kind of it's effed like up, man. I'm not gonna lie. Races of hosts. <sighs> these are they at least gave these me rice. Demons, they had questioning me. Let us see. Their talk of love was enough to make me vomit. That dude's got some big ass but eyes. Methods were not. Were not. Orthodox. Yuri and Polito. See, si. Yuri Polito. These are the fucks that tortured Ricky Sandoval was when you questioned him. I want them bad. Mm. We oh, okay. also run of the mill Sicarios when we free tomorrow. But I haven't seen Yuri and Polito in at least three days, maybe four. I don't know where they are now. We need more intel. We'll search every village and camp until we find something. Somebody's got to know something. Gather documents, hack computers, looks like a damn movie. <laughs> lieutenants, talk to civvies, whatever it takes. We'll turn over yeah. a new rock. My guy looks like a badass. <laughs> Mission come checkpoint. Oh, file on Yuri and Polito is coming through. That's the rundown on La Yuri and El Polito. They're a key part of Santa Blanca's security operation. Okay. So I'm gonna grab a sniper as my secondary. And so this has new parts. It says we're gonna customize this real quick. And what do we got in here? We got scope. Oh, all day. However, I do enjoy... Ooh, I don't know what the hell just happened there. Select. I want. That's what I want. And then, okay, so I already got that. I can paint you? <gasps> no way. Oh, yes, that one. I didn't know I could paint them. Yes. Oh, my gosh. This is legit. Can I paint you? No, I cannot. Unlock. Oh, what's way over there? Drone payload. Remote, remote detonation. Oh, legit. Oh, I have. Oh, I can upgrade. Stable aim, hip fire spread, drone items, a parachute. I need 550 of whatever the beacon thing is. A mine, diversion grenade, physical stamina, no pain, revive speed. 
We're going to go with stable aim. Because that's something I need to work on. And... Ooh, a night vision for my drone. Range. Increase by 25%. Increases battery life. I don't... I've never ran out of battery. We're going to have to go with that. Oh, remember to check out Bowman's briefing on the chain of command. Guy in charge of security is El Murrow, the wall. Personal bodyguard and childhood friend to El Sueño. El Murrow's little brother is La Plaga. Nasty piece of shit. Very active on social media. Head Sicario for the cartel. The hunt starts now. We want Sueño, we gotta work our way up the hierarchy. First targets are Yuri and Polito. We find the intel, we track them down, we take them out. Okay. Well, guys, this is going to end this first episode here. I'm so excited with this game. <laughs> it's a lot more detailed than I thought it was. Originally just loading into it and just kind of running through the woods and just shooting random stuff and just figuring out what I can do. So, guys, thank you so much for checking this out. And we'll see you guys in the next video. Take it easy.